all at once over there <sighs> but look at my roses I got these in the last vlog there's a lot more than I thought there would be I got the pink ones because they're pretty in pink so I've entered this new era of buying flowers for myself and no not related to the Miley Cyrus song but I just I love it when other people give me flowers and I'm like why do I wait around for other people to give me flowers? Like this is something that technically I could go to the store and buy for myself, right? We're thinking, we're thinking thoughts here. Okay, anyway though, the big problem is I haven't really ever bought flowers for myself so it's kind of a learning curve. So for example, this ended up being two dozen roses which I've never had that many roses before. Usually I end up getting like mixed bouquets from people, which is great and lovely, except for the fact that I didn't realize that two dozen roses were like this much. Like this was a lot of flowers. I've never had this many roses before. And I think usually when I end up getting flowers, it's like a mixed bouquet that is smaller and it fits perfectly in my little fake vase. This is my actual like pitcher for like lemonade and stuff. This, it looks overfilled. It looks ridiculous. It's like so many flowers in such a tiny vase. So things I've learned, I do not need two dozen roses. Though I also really want to go to the store and buy a second vase so I can like separate them into two. Like, but I don't think I'm going to have time for that today or tomorrow because guess what tomorrow is guys? Guess what tomorrow is? Are you ready? My sister and I are going to the TWICE concert. Mm -hmm. Okay, so TWICE, the K-pop group, is coming to Las Vegas, and my sister and I are going to go see it. I'm actually not sitting with my sister. I'm sitting with her friend Rosie's mom. You'll remember Rosie from the time we went to LA and the Uber driver almost ran over my foot vlog. You remember that vlog? You'll remember Rosie. I'm sitting next to her mom. Because we like, we were the late people. We got the tickets later than everybody else. <laughs> so everyone else is sitting together and like me and Rosie's mom are on like the extreme opposite side. But do you guys want to see the outfit for the concert? Great, because I do too. I haven't tried it on yet. <laughs> okay. I have not even opened this order yet. dresses yes you would you would be the pretty pretty princess you want some foodie let's go get you foodie be right back it's time for this week's rent the runway haul i'm so excited okay let's do this
these pants. out for the twice concert because I thought it would be like pretty and shimmery and partying. I mean it's very shimmery and I think part of the problem is it looks purple right but if you actually look at the fabric it's multi-colored it's like a shimmery rainbow. It does it looks like a strangely super high-end five-year-old girl's costume somehow. You know, the other thing it actually reminds me of is like a space princess, but from like a 90s kids movie. Like a 90s kids movie space princess would wear this dress, guys. She would rock it. Do I need to make a short where I'm like a 90s space princess? Probably. Like that's probably what I'll do with this dress while I have it. But here's my backup plan for the concert. Okay, so I have two alternate options to this dress. One is this very, really cute dress that I really love. And I think it goes K-pop girl group, right? Like, it's cute. It's like girly. I think K-pop girl group concert could totally rock this dress. Now, if I wanted to do over the top dress, this is my other option. So this dress is not from the Runway. I got this off of ASOS. I just wanted a princess dress, right? And I think it's like really cute and girly and princessy and pink and like could be great for a Twice concert. So I don't know if I'm gonna go blue or pink. I would say help me decide in the comments, but like I'm gonna have to decide by the time we see this video. Let me know what you think I should pick. What, what do you think I'm going to pick in this video? What do you want me to pick, sir? The elderly gentleman cat has come to greet us. He wants to remind you to like, subscribe, and comment down below. Which dress do you think I should pick? <laughs> Is that what you wanted to tell them? You're such a good little like reminder. Yes, you are. to get into the parking of this place. 
This is crazy. <laughs> we are trying. We're trying to, and it's not why working. Why is our lot and, and why is the road closed? Yes. We don't know why. I don't know how long. We were almost there. I don't know. <laughs> I just think it's not very well designed because it was like crazy, oh, like this at the BTS concert too. <laughs> it was like this at the BTS slow. concert. Mm -hmm. So dumb. No, they their parking even, situation is so traffic bad. Traffic was even worse. Yeah, too. like <laughs> Super Bowl was actually insanity. We, they had the the National Guard. Bruh, that's right crazy. By our carts. I was like, I feel safe. Okay. Dean Martin. Oh, okay. Which is the okay. other side of okay. the stadium. Do you have then all you this? Like, right okay. Yeah, I can. Yeah, oh, I remember. The maps. Yeah. Okay. 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 Right. So flip around. So go down to the light, and then once. <gasps> Why does nobody know what they're doing? Ridiculous. <laughs> Now I'm just waiting for love. Look at the beautiful parking lot. It's so here. We're here. So these are the porta potties. <laughs> And they're actually, well, this one was really great. This one did not get as great of reviews, but this was brilliant. Waiting for
got one good one, guys. How was concert, guys? Great! Yeah, we are so good. Yeah, it is so cold. I am dying. We need more. <laughs> just been my pre getting ready for bed nap. Does anyone else take those? <laughs> like when you're too tired to wash your face and brush your teeth, but you know you need to, but you also need to like sleep first. <laughs> Actually up and getting ready for bed. I should win an award. I don't know what award that would be, but it's mine. <laughs> I still don't know what award I'm winning for getting ready for bed, but I would like to thank my mom who drilled it into me that I have to take off my makeup every night for the health of my skin. <laughs> oh, I'm so tired, guys. <sighs> guys, it's 3 a.m. And yes, I still have my retainer in, so if my voice sounds weird, that's why. Um, basically, I try to go to bed, but then I started shivering uncontrollably, which is what happens when I get over-exhausted. So I've shared before about how I have something called postural orthostatic tachycardia syndrome, which obviously has a big impact on my blood pressure. But it, it also causes dysregulation in your whole autonomic nervous system. And your autonomic nervous system is like what runs your body's functions. Like, in this case, body temperature. So I was just laying there uncontrollably shivering. 
and like no matter how many blankets I had on me, it wasn't stopping. So I just had to get up, get in the shower, my hair's all wet now, and just stand there in hot water until my body temperature rose. Like that's the only solution. Or like at home, I do have like a heated mattress pad that also can help bring up my body temperature. I was realizing what I need to buy is a heated blanket that I can take places with me. See, thinking, we're thinking here. But the same exact thing happened when I went to the Stray Kids concert in LA a couple of years ago. After I got back to the hotel, I was so out of it and I was so shivering and stuff. At a certain point, I just stopped vlogging. I really wanted to vlog it this time because I know quite a few of you who watch my channel have chronic illnesses too. And sometimes it can be easy to look at other people's lives, even other people with chronic illnesses lives on like social media and stuff and be like, how do they do all this stuff? Right? Like if I did that, I'd like die. <laughs> And I guess I just don't want to be the YouTuber who just cuts out all of the times my chronic illnesses are like low-key ruining my life so I can give you a more balanced perspective and let you know that you're not alone, right? I think that's one of the really hard things about chronic illness is it gives you consequences to normal actions. <laughs> I hate, like, other people can go to a K-pop concert and, yeah, be tired when they go back to their hotel room, but, like, they're not uncontrollably shivering, having to go stand in a shower for probably, like, half an hour or something. It's just a sad fact of living with chronic illness. <sighs> anyway. I just thought I'd share that. I am feeling warmer now. Like I, I stay in the shower until I start like sweating, right? Like that it raises my blood, my body temperature that much. Um, and so I think I should be able to go to sleep now because I am really, really tired. Anyway, guys, I'm gonna go to sleep. I hope you guys have an awesome and amazing life. Since we last talked But now you're hitting me up Telling me that it's been too long And you wanna meet up You said your favorite coffee shop Was just on the block So we met up for a cup I'm trying to see like Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah and I bet like salads. And I also have a question about your gluten free um pancakes. What type of flour is that made out of? Well, which one? The gluten free? Yeah. That one that is going to be the, uh, the corn flour. I don't know what it's like. I'll, I'll confirm. I'm pretty sure it's the corn flour. Okay. So it'll be on the gluten free pancake. You were on your phone the whole time What was up with that? Cause if you wanted me, talk to me Don't be hiding behind your screen I got too much stuff to do For you to be so rude Said you like real conversation But you don't know how to make them Nah, -uh. from my point of view I don't see how this is fun for you Said that you had a good time You wanna do it again? Don't know why I texted back I guess that I'll see you then Well now I'm waiting for you here yeah. When you call up my phone Say you're sorry you forgot And left me on my own But you're the one who wanted my time What is up with that? Cause if you wanted me, talk to me